I get a lot of questions about how to assign a color dynamically to one of my textured styles, like paper cut, which is just a single polygon style that looks like a white piece of paper. But if you look at the symbol layers, you can see this little lock is unlocked. Everything else, all the graphical layers, are locked, which means they can't change dynamically in the symbology panel. But this guy is unlocked, which gives us some cool options. And you aren't stuck with just white cardboard looking paper in here. And I'll show you what I mean. So here's a map with some Crater Lake polygon contours. I'll open the symbology panel and I'll choose graduated colors based on elevation. I'll max this out so we get a lot of color variation. Okay, now there's this little more button in the classes area and if I choose format all symbols now I can point to this style and it will render all of these as the white papers which takes a little bit because it's just so glorious but we're not stuck with white like I said so if I hit back and I just reselect this color scheme or select any other color scheme for that matter it will dynamically assign that color to that little color polygon in my layer and now I've got colored paper which is really fun